Can I get three marriages for you, though? Ooh, you got one good marriage a little bit later in your life. First marriage is good. Now, let me get to the side of that hand. Uh, look at the end of the heart line. See, you got little tassels on the end of it. Those are, those are flirt lines. Here's excellent flirt lines. Actually, it means you interact well with people. And then that space in between the end of the heart line and the ring around the little finger, that's where your marriage lines show. And the marriage lines start at the outside of the hand, and they come in towards the palm. They don't have a real distinct timeline on them, but you can kind of eyeball it to see how long they're going to be. I can see one relationship line in there. It's real faint. So I'm reading up the first third from the end of the heart line up to the ring around the little finger. The first third of that, that's about age 20, 30. The next third is about, uh, third is about 40, 50. And the last third is about 60, 70, 80. So I get one marriage line in there, but he dies before you do because it tips down on the end. It's about 20 years long. Then your second marriage line is very good. It's quite long, maybe 30 years long. But again, the spouse dies first because it tips down on the end. Then that third marriage line is just a little shorty pie. Probably not even hardly 10 years. Maybe just 10 years. That's later in your life. So the only way I can tell when you're going to marry is it, uh, on the left hand on that faint line and that's the line that starts at, down at the bottom of your palm travels up to that uh, Saturn line and that's got a good timeline on it. about every uh, half an inch is about seven years about every eighth of an inch is about a year where that faint line crosses over the headline that's about age 42 so that's how you time that what happens in that fate line on your left hand only this is in the past hand it'll you'll get a little mark in there that's a chance to marry and it's a little mark that looks like a, a the letter Y or at least the top part of the letter Y where it forks out a little bit here's the ages that I can find on your chances to marry you've got one right now at age 32 so I look along on that left hand, I look along that fate line to see where these little Y marks are. At age 32, at 38, at 40, at 44, 46, and I've got 46 underlined, which might be like the second marriage there. And then, let's see, 46 is underlined, 48, 63, and 65, that's probably that last little marriage line. Uh, and that's about the only way that I can tell on, on the lines. But then remember, you're the master of your fate, and you're the one that runs your life. Doesn't necessarily mean it's ab absolutely going to happen. You're the one that makes the choices in your life.